Hello, it's Flo and today uh, I want to show you on my HTC One S uh, how to install the Viper One S custom ROM. So currently I am on the Android version. Okay, so let's go there to show you that I am not on Viper S version. So this is the Android version. And I want to show you how to install the uh, Viper One S because some people is asking me. So first thing to do is to download the Viper uh, 1S custom ROM and the boot.img on the uh, thread of this uh, of, uh, of the on the thread, excuse me so you download the Viper 1S and the boot IMG uh, flash script for Viper you have to uh, catch it, you have seen also I am downloaded a Virtus Infinity version 1.35 for um, the Desire HD because yes, I continue to record videos. Okay, so there I have to paste uh, my different files, uh, Viper 1S, and I have to connect my HTC One S uh, there to the computer, by this way, you know how to do that. Then I have to choose, uh, excuse me, there, the disk drive and that. Okay, um, I have to just unzip the uh, boot.img from, from the Viper, continue without analyzing. Uh, extract there. Okay. Also, I have to uh, to put the Viper One S on the HTC One S. Okay. So there on um, uh, my documents and ROM there the Viper One S on the ROM. Okay. At the same time, I have there uh, the boot IMG, and we must flash it just after having uh, done the the flash of the custom ROM. Okay, so here is different files. You have the Mac, Linux, and uh, Windows uh, Windows files. So if we just read the thread, uh, we must just do uh, different things, and we have to follow some instructions. So first thing is you can just see my YouTube channel. Also, there is, there is a lot of custom ROM uh, reviews for you. During the time. There is also 60 seconds there to copy that. Okay, so there is tweaks for for the Viper S, and I just have to. Uh, I don't want to review it. I have already done that. This is just the auto installation. So we have to download the load the room, connect your One S, HTC Sync, and check fast boot. So you have to go. But I already have that. This is for you. Good settings. Go there to power. On power you must uncheck fast boot there so your your custom room is just uh, there going to your one s okay uh, press and hold after you configure it your boot bootloader in fast boot mode depending okay so I have to to start by flashing the custom ROM so also 15 seconds then <coughs> Yes, um, so I have to review different apps and currently I want to show you a new application I have discovered. This is the My App Sharer and this is just an amazing, uh, an amazing app. So here is uh, the file on my HTC One S. So let's go to charge only there. And I have to reboot my phone, disconnect it and restart with recovery mode like that. You must uh, maybe Mm, do an Android backup. I have done that for the Android version. So let's go. Let's go to turn it off. There. Then you have to uh, turn it on on recovery mode. Oh, no, it's start on recovery mode. I am so mad. Okay, so it start on recovery mode. There. We just have to to do a full wipe and full uh, full wipe so for cache and. Uh, so cache and data, yes wipe cache, there, yes wipe data, yes delete it, there, then we have to install zip, so uh, in recovery choose install zip, press power, ok, choose zip, I just follow the instruction because I know how to do but I'm not sure maybe for some ties, rom uh, viper 1s, yes install viper 1s, so let's go to start a rom installer, there, chim venon, there, Click next, click agree, click next. Uh, you have to select uh, the full installation or custom one. So custom installation, perform full wipe. There, 
additional uh, additions so you can change for uh, maybe stop boot animation sense 4.1 camera uh, film red film htc sense uh, complete removal or not app removal select for removing apps you can select it if you want to remove some apps so i don't want to do that so currently i have to install it there erasing um, after you configure it, reboot your bootloader mode in fast boot mode. No, you can explain. Yes, so just after that, we have to flash the boot animation. So, to do that, uh, at the end of the installation, we have to choose uh, restart in bootloader mode. So, it is just uh, going on. So, to show you the my app share, I have needed it just uh, because I want to I don't want to download different apps from my One X I have already on my One S so I have uh, trying to find uh, an application to share my app and it's it's just amazing you can share APK or uh, the link of uh, the application this is just uh, an amazing thing okay so H2 persons waiting system and I love uh, our commenter or comments on my uh, one x uh, video so thanks to follow me so we have to click next and then uh, reboot your phone so you have to press volume done just to reboot uh, to fast boot mode by this way just press it and it must reboot on fast boot mode i hope by this way because you need to install the boot img uh, to restart your phone. Oh no, it didn't start on fast boot mode. So let's go to wait it. Maybe we can do something like that. Okay, we maybe have to, to test something. Yes, boot, anim boot is just not here, so we have to p have long press and power button and it just restart the phone by this way, you know. There and press the uh, volume down button and it must restart on fast boot mode there okay uh, on fast boot mode you can now just click there to go fast boot and we have to go there with fast boot usb then we have to go on our folder with uh, flash boot windows .bat, and it will just flash it so let's go to follow it there Sending boot, okay, watching boot, okay, flashing, okay, cache, if not trying, wait, continue, by this way, enjoying Viper, okay, so continue, and by this way we can now, not, yes, reboot put loader if we need, uh, but we can also just reboot our phone, uh, we, yes, we need to reboot on bootloader mode because uh, we need to go on the recovery, Excuse me, there on the recovery, and we have to um, to wipe. Uh, to we have to wipe uh, wipe cache just to to be sure uh, to secure that. So let's go there and wipe cache. Yes, wipe cache there, and we have to reboot system now. And we must have the Viper One S on our HTC One S. <coughs> let's just go to start the phone just to be sure and then I will just uh, thank you to have seen this video and uh, share it and install the Viper One S on your HTC One S okay so HTC and we must have a boot animation with maybe a snake I know maybe yes and so we have the boot animation from Viper One S so this is because uh, it works. So I have to go on Facebook just to uh, give to people uh, the way that this video is done. And you can follow me on uh, Facebook. You can also check my blog there. The flow wolf one dot blogspot dot fr with different uh, uh, how-tos and different uh, videos. For example, install Jelly Bean on HTC One X with Maximus. Uh, we have there. Uh, Okay, we have this one. 
there and there we have this is not the space one so yes this is Gemini 1s okay and there we have to just share with you uh, Viper 1s installation installation coming up there and we have to share it uh, just when we got it if uh, your phone does not restart like that you can also test to restart it by this this way and it must uh, restart so let's go to test it because sometimes it done that there is no reboot or boot uh, loop but there is just something like that so we have to restart it reboot it if you prefer okay so i have to just check uh, pupil there confirm this way uh to that person's follow cool thanks to my video uh, like my link like my link like my link disconnect your phone from computer okay so i have to check that later so you can go there and you have also my uh, okay so you see it works i have said the, the good things so oh yes i was doing that okay so it works uh viper 1s installation review is coming for 1s owners publish it there okay so viper 1s installation uh whoops no well Okay, so still there, and we have the Viper 1S on, or HTC 1S. Uh, you can also follow to get tweaks, you can also follow the uh, the XGA thread to get uh, different mods and other things. So, my HTC 1S with Viper 1S there. So, I am just uh, compiling the Lidroid version for my HTC 1X, so it's coming just soon. Thanks to have seen this video. That's